Hi guys, first I want to say that I'm really sorry that yesterday's video didn't get up and so today's video I am going to intermingle the two. So I, I had a doctor's appointment and I had to be in Tampa at 9 o'clock so I had to leave the house at 7.30 this morning. So I didn't get home today after everything was done until almost 6 o'clock in the evening. It is now like 7.30 at night. And I'm finally getting time to sit down and do day 20. Recorded yesterday's video in the morning, but then I had to get ready and I had to go up to the mall and a couple of the stores to pick up some last minute stuff that I needed for the grandkids. And it was crazy. I couldn't find a parking space. I couldn't, I had to wait in line to go into the stores. The stores of course are crowded and crazy and me thinking I'm going to be home in an early time frame, like no later than eight o'clock at night, and I could put the video up. Um, I didn't get home last night until after midnight. And then this morning, first part of the video is going to be yesterday's video that I recorded, day 19. And then I'm going to cut in again, and uh, we're going to open up day 20 together. And then the rest of the video will be what I recorded yesterday. So I hope that'll work for you guys. Welcome back, my friends, to Twisted Stitches. My name is Tammy. How is everybody doing? And I am here today to open up the 2021 Christmas Advent from Felicity Yarn Studios featuring the art inspired, featuring the art inspired by Georgia O'Keeffe. Art Yarn inspired by the artwork of Georgia O'Keeffe. There, that might be good. Anyway, I hope your weekend has been wonderful and I hope you're having a blessed Sunday. So let's take a look at today's inspirational art piece, shall we? This is called Jimson Weed number three. Now, you guys may be a little bit familiar with this because this was actually a commissioned piece for um, Elizabeth Arden, the uh, cosme the cosmetic executive, Elizabeth Arden. Yep. She commissioned Miss O'Keefe to do a painting for her. So this particular painting was done in 1936 and it stated it was an oil on linen. I couldn't find anything else about it, but that it was an oil on linen. So like I said, the cosmetics executive, Elizabeth Arden, commissioned Mrs. O'Keefe to paint I don't know if it was like she wanted that and that's what she asked for or if it was just she commissioned Miss O'Keefe to do a painting and this is what Miss O'Keefe decided to do. Mrs. Arden wanted this piece because she wanted to hang it in the exercise room of the Sport Salon in New York. The result was the largest of her flower paintings. So I guess this is the largest of her flower paintings. It didn't give me dimensions. I have no idea. So, so that's all the information I have about this particular painting. If you guys have more information about this, leave it in the comment section below and help us go down a rabbit hole and find some more information. So here is day 19, guys. Are you ready? I know I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. <laughs> This is lovely colors. Look, guys. Look. Oh, my goodness. Oh, look at these colors. They're so pretty. That is really pretty. Now, here is the inspirational artwork. And here is the colors that we have. I don't know. I mean, I guess if you blend the colors, you'll get these gorgeous colors like this. But this is really, really pretty. I don't know if it's a match. I couldn't tell you. I can't tell you what uh, I can't tell you what Zoe was thinking when she made this. Maybe she didn't want to have a bunch of white in it, so she kind of blended the whites, the greens, the blues, the yellows, a little bit of brown in there, and she came up with this beautiful color. This is a gorgeous color. It is spectacularly gorgeous. So there you have it, the 2021 Christmas Advent from Felicity Yarn Studios featuring the art inspiration of Miss Georgia O'Keeffe. So we're ready to put it on our handy dandy wooden dowel. Oh, it's getting heavy here. So here is so far we have days one through 18 and let's put day 19 on here. Give her a little tug. There we go. So let's see if we can see it all in one shot. 
I'll back it up a little bit just in case. Oh, it's so pretty, so pretty. There you have it, guys. Day 19 of the Christmas Advent. Oh so for today's inspirational artwork by Georgia O'Keeffe, the painting is called Ladder to the Moon. Now, once again, I have two, two pictures to show you. So I showed you this one. And then I also found one that looked like this. And then, like I said in a previous video, a couple of a day or two ago, that I am having where I'm finding a couple of different, I'm finding a couple of different variations of the colors and hues. So I'm hoping that the hues are more like this. This is more of a green blue uh, with dark, dark green, black, gray type mountains in the background. So that's what I'm hoping that we're going to get in the yarn today. So a little bit of information about this particular painting. This painting was done in 1958. The painting is called Ladder to the Moon. The painting depicts a ladder suspended in a turquoise sky. In the background is a pitch black, well they said a pitch black mountain range way off in the distance called the I think I'm gonna say this right, Paderno, Paderno Mountains. And these mountain, this mountain range is in New Mexico. So there are the pitch black Paderno Mountains in the background and a silver half moon with the ladder suspended in a turquoise sky. They say that this painting is very similar to a picture that was of Miss O'Keefe at her home in New Mexico, leaning up against her home. And there was a ladder leaning up against her home to her rooftop where she liked to go to relax. She liked to get up on her rooftop and relax. And uh, in the background, you could see these, the mountain range, Paderno, Paderno, I'm not saying it right, I know that, Paderno mountain range in the background. Some speculate that this ladder is just, she took everything out except the mountain ranges and the ladder while others interpret it as uh, a religious work of art. Um, Miss O'Keefe studied the Pueblo civilization while she was in New Mexico. And they're saying that in the Pueblo culture, the ladder in the sky was, was a symbol. It symbolized the link between the Pueblos and cosmic forces. So there's a brief piece of history about today's inspirational artwork. And here is day 20 in my hands. Are we ready to open it up and see what it looks like? I know I'm curious. Well, the first thing I got is this yummy tea, stash tea called Christmas Eve. And it states the ingredients are cinnamon, spearmint, orange peel, vanilla extract, orange oil, natural cinnamon flavor, and clove bud oil. And that sounds like it's going to be delicious. So this was my extra. Are you guys ready to see this? Are you guys ready to see this? I mean, like seriously, it is. It's gorgeous, it's gorgeous. Okay, did I make you suffer long enough? Look at this art. Look at this yard. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. It is absolutely gorgeous. Look at those colors, guys. Look at them. It is definitely turquoise. It is definitely like the very first picture I showed you. I will get that picture up for you and we can compare. So here is today's yart. And here is the painting. I know it's hard to tell by the video, but this color isn't like blue. It is very turquoise, very turquoise. So if you go look it up yourself, I'll actually leave a link to this particular painting. If you want to just click it, you can go take a look at it for yourself because my camera is not picking up all the colors true to life. This is This color really is similar to the color that's on this painting right here. This... Yeah, very, very, like a really good interpretation of the colors that are here. So there you go. Look at that gorgeousness. So there you go, guys. Here is day 20 of the 2021 Christmas Advent from Felicity Yarn Studios featuring the artwork of Miss Georgia O'Keefe.
I look forward to seeing you guys and I appreciate you guys always coming back, hanging out with me, supporting my channel by liking, subscribing, sharing, and doing all that stuff that you guys do. You guys rock. So until tomorrow, when I see you again, stay safe, stay healthy, and stay creative. Love you guys. You're the best. Bye.